Welcome to Golden Valley Middle School New Student Orientation. In this presentation, you will virtually tour our campus and learn important information about our school. But before we begin, I would like for us to take a tour of our campus. We'll be looking at the bus area, the front office, the library, the PE locker area, and the lunch area. Our bus loading zone is located at Parkdale Drive. If you're riding the bus or being dropped off, this would be the main entrance to our school. These portables are our CAPS area. If you are having CAPS, staying after school for CAPS, this is where you will be. As you make your way to our campus, you will notice benches. These benches are meant for you to have your lunch in or your breakfast. To your left, you will see more benches for you to sit and enjoy your lunch. Now we will be taking a tour of the front office. The door that you see is the door to the health aid. And this is the attendance window. And this is the main entrance to the front office. If there's anything you need assistance with, you can please ask any of the front office staff and they'll be more than happy to help you. Now let's take a tour of our library. This is the entrance to the library. When you walk in to your right, Mrs. Zilch, our librarian, will be able to assist you. As you can see, we have many books and make many tables for you to sit and do your work and read. And this is the library at our school. Now, let, now let's take a look at the PE area. This is the area you will enter to dress out for PE. In the first, first door, this is for the girls' PE locker area. The second door is the boys' PE locker area. As you enter, you will see the lockers, and this is where you will hold your locker and your PE clothes will be in there. Your personal belongings will be stored in here while you dress out for PE. We always tell our students to please do not share your locker combination with any other student, including your best friend, because we don't want anything or anybody to get into your things and lose any of your belongings. As you can see, this is the exit. And this is our basketball area. And these are the benches you will sit and wait for your teacher to, for your class to begin. And now we will take a look at the lunch area. In this area, you line up to get your lunch and we'll follow instructions as to when to approach the lunch line. This is the area where you'll line up and put in your number and receive your lunch. As you can see, we also have the MU room, the cafeteria. This is where you would enter get a salad if that's what you want to eat, or just hang out in here and have your lunch. This is also the area where we have our assemblies. And this is the bench area for you to have your lunch. And that ends our tour of our campus. Now I would like for you to meet our administration team, our principal, Mr. Diaz, our two vice principals, Mrs. Bonjour and Mrs. White. So who and what is Golden Valley? At Golden Valley, we take pride in our spirit competition. We have, we have five teams in our school. If you're in sixth grade, you'll be part of the Wizards team. If you're in seventh grade, you will be Excalibur or Crusader. If you're in eighth grade, you'll be a Camelot or a Falcon. We have seven periods at middle school, seven classes. You will have English, math, science, social studies, UA, which is a support class for language arts, PE, an elective. Each class is 40 mi 8, 48 minutes long with a passing period of four minutes. This gives you enough time to go to one class and the next 
and use the restroom or get a drink of water if you need to. Remember, you need to be in your seat when the bell rings in order to not be marked tardy. We also have two 30-minute lunches. Our schedule. As you can see, it's a bit different from elementary school. We start at 7.40 a.m. and end at 2.11, Tuesday through Friday. We always tell our students to please arrive on time. If you arrive around 7.20, that will give you enough time for you to have your breakfast and socialize with your friends. On Mondays, we have late start. We start at 9.45 and end at 2.35. Please take a look at these times and remember them. I know it's a big change from elementary school. We kind of have to wake up a little bit earlier. Now, I would like to go over our school expectations. Here at Golden Valley, we believe that all our students are more than capable to be successful. In order to do this, we're asking all our students to be on time every day. Be prepared every day. Bring your paper and pencil, your binder, an AR book, and a charge Chromebook. Complete all your assignments, in class and homework. Stay on top of your grades so you don't get behind. We also have a couple of rules that we expect our students to follow, and that is our dress code. More information will be provided to you at the start of school. Phones. We ask our students to please have their phones turned off and put away at all times while on campus. Chromebooks. Something that is very important for us here at Golden Valley is for you to have your Chromebook every day. As we all experience during distant learning, our Chromebooks have become very valuable to our education. All of your teachers use a Chromebook and all of your books will be online. So we're asking you to please come prepared with your Chromebook charge and also remember, please take care of them. Treat them like they're a valuable possession of yours. We will have charging stations in the MU room for you to charge your um, laptop during breakfast and lunchtime. Just follow the posted charging station expectations. So what is different about middle school? One of the biggest difference is PE. You will have PE every day. It's actually a period that you're gonna have. You're required to dress out for PE every day. If you do not bring your PE clothes, you will be required to wear a loner. And please remember, do not give out your locker combination to any of your friends. We do not want anything to happen to your clothing or to your possessions. Also remember to please take your PE clothes home on Friday so you can wash them. Unless you want to leave them there the whole weekend and they're going to smell when you come back to school on Monday. Another difference that we have here in middle school is sports. You actually get to um, participate in any sport activity. We have volleyball, we have cross country, we have softball, basketball, cheer, and soccer. Please pay attention to the morning announcement or any information that is going to be given out throughout the year if you want to be part of the sport teams. Also, electives. You get to have an elective. You will either have technology, yearbook, ASB, music, AVID, Spanish, or STEM. More information about the electives are coming up. And you also have two, two counselors. Myself, Ms. Barajas, I am the 6th and 7th grade counselor. Mr. Turner, who will be the 8th grade and special ed counselor. We are here to help if you ever need anything. The Nightly Lounge. We are so happy to introduce to you our Nightly Lounge. This is a place for you to relax and make friends, and it's open to you every lunch. You do need to have a pass in order to enter the Nightly Lounge, but once you do enter, you'll be able to participate in the many activities. We have different fun corners. We have an art corner, we have a game corner, and we also have a manipulatives corner, which means we have fidgets, we have stand, we have Orbeez for you to hang out and play with your friends. The AVID elective. AVID, what is AVID, you ask? AVID is, uh, our goal in AVID is to help develop the skills and knowledge you succeed in all your classes and build awareness for college and career options. So what do you do in AVID? You set goals and you develop plans, you build study skills and work habits, you collaborate through team building activities, you explore college, and if possible, if we're allowed to, we'll be able to tour campuses. Now our music collective. You will hear now from Mrs. McCullough, our music teacher. Hi, I'm Miss McCullough. In music, you can take choir, that's singing. You can take band, play the flute, clarinet, saxophone, trumpet, or drums. You can take orchestra, play the violin, viola, cello, or bass. Or you can take music appreciation, where you can learn about different styles of music, learn a little bit about the history of music, and listen to music. Now we're going to hear about our ASB Yearbook Collective being taught by Mrs. Lycon. Golden Valley offers an ASB yearbook elective. It is a year-long class that works to promote school spirit and student leadership. 
We will have activities throughout the year, like spirit competitions on Fridays, dances, a carnival, and fundraisers. You will also be designing the yearbook that includes going to sporting events to take pictures. As a member of ASB Yearbook, students will be working on developing their time management, public speaking, and communication skills. This is an application only class. You do need to apply to be accepted into leadership. We will be giving you the application for you to fill out online. You do need to have grades of C or better and a recommendation letter from your teacher. Thank you. And now we're gonna hear from Mrs. Lycon again. She's also a technology teacher. Golden Valley offers a technology elective. It is different from the STEM elective. In technology, you will learn Google Suites. You will learn docs, slides, sheets, drawings, forms, and sites. You will also be doing computer repair throughout the year. You will be repairing student Chromebooks. We will repair screens, keyboards, keys, touchpads, batteries, DC jacks, and more. You will also learn how to do 3D printing. We are going to use the Tinkercad program and you will design and print 3D objects in class. And last but not least, we will also be doing Lego robotics. You will use the Lego Mindstorms to learn block coding. You are going to be able to program the robot to do all sorts of really cool things, including obstacle courses. And now you're gonna hear from a STEM teacher. Golden Valley STEM. STEM stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. Learn how these things are in every part of our everyday lives. Sometimes we don't even realize. Like for instance, the bridge that you may have seen over the freeway, you never thought that it incorporated engineering and math. Well, in this class, we explore those things. We do lots of hands-on projects that let you see how it works in real life. Maybe from building a bridge to a hovercraft or even building a cell. We explore possibilities on how to make them better, how to perfect the design, and we even do technology and coding. There's lots of things for you to check out in this class, lots of things to learn, and I hope I get a chance to meet you. And we also have a Spanish elective. This Spanish class is for new students learning Spanish. You will learn basic skills um, regarding Spanish topics as numbers, the alphabet, colors, common phrases, adjectives, verbs, and among other things. This will help you prepare for high school Spanish. We also have fun stuff at Golden Valley. Like I mentioned before, we have the nightly lounge. We also have Friday lunch activities and music. Our wonderful ASB students are the ones who organize and arrange all of our Friday lunch activities. We have music, we have different spirit point days, spirit competitions, which I mentioned before, we are very, very a spirit point driven school. Our teachers are very competitive as well as all our staff. We participate in Disney, Twin Days, Crazy Hair Day, Halloween dress up, very exciting. We always love to root for our favorite um, team. So again, we have spirit days at our school. We also have school dances and carnival, again, if permitted. And lastly, we have field trips, if, again, we're permitted due to COVID. I know in the past we have many of our teachers or many of our grades and our teams who are visiting either the beach, they go to the desert, living desert, they um, participate in many fun activities. So hopefully we're able to do that this year. So how do you prepare for middle school? We have asked you to please have your materials ready on the first day of school, and that means your Chromebook charge. You will be able to buy your PE clothes the first week of school and dressing out will not be required the first week. We ask you to please get to school early, especially on the first day of school, so you can locate your class and get your schedule. Counselor contact. If you need more information, this is my information, Ms. Barajas, my email, and also my Google site. And this is from Mr. Turner. Like I said, he's the eighth grade counselor and special ed. If you need to get a hold of us prior to school starting, please stop down our email and contact us. We'll be more than happy to help. Again, I want to thank you for taking the time to listen to this presentation. We so look forward to seeing you on campus. Remember, we are the home of the Knights, and we expect all our students to be successful.